because we've been wanting to go to state for like the past four years and it happened and we're grateful for it. We go to a, a very tough sectional with Belleville, O'Fallon, Belleville East, Belleville West, Edwardsville. So to, to emerge out of that and go to state is a, is a huge win for them. It feels good, like I've accomplished a goal, but not just like by myself, but with my twin sister. As they embark today on the swan song of their dynamite tennis careers, Phoebe and Lily Hayes do so with a noble purpose. Knowing that this is our last year, like playing tennis together, we can have fun and just enjoy and play like audience of one, play for God, because that's how we got here, it's for God. A lot of combined and collaborative court assets at the ready at Hoffman Estates. And they really have a lot of weapons that uh, other teams don't have. I mean, they hit the ball with a lot of pace. A lot of girls aren't ready for that. Um, they, they both serve really well, uh, and they're both good athletes. I mean, they went out for track, you know, in the, uh, last year. As a pair, they're, they're always in the match, whatever, whatever it may be. They're really never out of it, and they're always capable of coming back. And yes, some twin telekinesis still working in their favor. There are some shots where we don't communicate, but like if we don't say switch for like when we're playing doubles, if I don't say switch, she'll automatically go to that spot because she knows that's where like to go and stuff like that. Sometimes like when she goes to the other side of the court, you usually say switch, and half the time she doesn't do that. She just takes my balls and stuff and hits them into the net, but it's fine or it's fine. For the uninitiated and unfamiliar, namely opponents, it's sometimes difficult to differentiate between Lily and Phoebe on the court on first glance. Yeah, there is a team we played. They were confused on like which one of us was serving like that, but it kind of helps us we match together like they can't tell us apart when we match and that helps like our strategy. Yeah, it's annoying because she's taller and I have two scars and she only has one, but it's fine. But the strength of why this duo works so well together and on occasion admittedly not as well is the individuality of these two talented young women who can morph from comedy troupe to reality show to triumphant sister act all in a single set. It's been like good because we have a connection with each other and we know what to do when we get on the court and we play together as a team. Yeah, I think playing with the sibling sometimes it can be a little bit of yeah. uh, bickering back and forth. Does that ever happen between you two? Yeah, it has, but I just get over it. It's mainly her, but it's fine. I think it goes both ways. Like she's like funnier in general, but when there's a serious moment on the court. I try to like make it light and joke around with her. Probably I'm the funniest because she's boring and she's too like, she's too serious and she doesn't know when to take a joke. They're obviously sisters and, and you know, they, they sometimes have issues like that, but, but they really come together in big moments, I think.